we are going to. I, I agree with some aspects of the bill, like yeah, the, you know, the yeah. publishing yeah. of the health advice, tabling things mm. in Parliament, all that's great. Um, making sure that it's the elected politicians who take responsibility yeah. rather than faceless bureaucrats. Yeah. But yeah. I don't like. There's two things I don't like. One is that the, a pandemic could be extended forever. Yeah. That's point yeah. one. Point two, there are some pretty broad powers about locking people up. Like it could be that I don't wear a mask out in public because I've forgotten mine and bang, I can be arrested. And I can't even appeal to a court. I can appeal to a bureaucrat to let me out. But, but, but no. I, could, I could be kept in jail. No. That, that, well, that, it does that say that. Actually, no, it doesn't. The, oh, sorry, Tom. I, like, I am literally going through this with a fine tooth comb. And this is Section 165, which is about detentions. And they... they they can't detain you for that. And in actual fact, we just passed terrorism legislation yesterday in the parliament, which didn't get a peep from anyone that actually allowed us to detain people if we thought they might be thinking about doing something. You know, we didn't have to have any evidence. We, don't, we didn't have to lay any charges and we could detain them without legal representation. Um, and we've, we've just passed that. that. That just went flying well, through you, the you, parliament you, this week. Fine. You mentioned um, section 165. One, 